Good morning, Warren class. I hope you have enjoyed looking at the first couple of pages of Strike Island. And well done for those of you that have written sentences and joined them with the word and. Now I'm going to read to you the rest of the story. I hope you enjoy it. Stripe Island. The striped sun rises over Stripe Island. Good morning, everyone. On Stripe Island, everything is stripy. The mountains, the fields, the trees, the flowers. And even the people. Look, a striped boy called Stanley is running home to his stripy house with its red and yellow striped roof. Stanley's mother knits splendid stripy sweaters. Stanley's father adds up stripy sums and solves stripy problems. Stanley's family lives in Stripe City and, would you believe it, today is the Festival of Stripes. Everyone dresses in their finest stripes. The striped baker, the striped optician, the striped florist and the stripy-haired barber. How stunning! Festival of Stripes. Come and celebrate. Stripes. Stripey stripes, stripey stripes on stripes. Stripes of all sorts. The stripier, the better. All welcome. Roll up, roll up for spectacular stripey acts with stripes like you've never seen before. A stripy crowd cheers and dances in the stripy town square. Then the stripy acts start on the big stripy stage. See the striptastic singing bears. And the striped strongman who lifts a snoozing striped elephant the size of a stadium. And what's this? Have you ever seen such a stupendously long, spiralling, stripy beard? Ta-da! See the most scrumptious, stripiest cake in the world. Wow, a striped acrobatic baboon soars high over the crowd. Sensational! Check out Professor Stripe's super stripy machine that makes super useful stripy stuff. For the teeniest, tiniest stripy bug you've ever seen. And look, it's Stanley again. He's on stage springing up and down in his splendid new stripy sweater. At the end of the day, there's a striped sticky bun for everyone. What a lot of super stripes. Which is your stripey favourite? The striped moon rises over Stripe Island. Tomorrow will be another beautiful stripey day. Sweet stripey dreams, everyone.
that is the end of the story. What do you think? I hope you like it. Now what I would like you to do is to go back through the story again, have another read and see if you can really get to know the book. Really have a good look. What can you see? What is going on? Have a talk about it. Are there parts that you like, parts that you don't like? Also have a look to see if you can find some question marks, some exclamation marks. Really get familiar with the story so that tomorrow we can use another part of the book to do some more writing. Have fun. See you soon. Bye.